Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for this video, I'm going to be drawing John Cena. <laughs> okay, not that John Cena. That John Cena. They're very similar. Some people confuse them all the time, but they're totally different people. So before I get into the video, let me explain why I'm doing this. So I go to high school. I'm a senior. All my freaking classes are hard. So I just decide to take regular art. And in regular art, there's like almost no seniors taking it because no senior takes regular art. But I was like, let me just have an easy A. So at first it's fine, but then it starts getting like so tedious drawing all the time when I don't want to draw because like I love drawing. But when I'm forced to draw something, it's like child labor. But the reason I'm drawing Joanna Sedia is because our new project in art is to make a self-portrait. Yeah. Disgusting. Yes. Disgusting. Disgusting! I don't want to freaking draw myself. I have to get used to drawing other people so I can know how to draw myself really quickly. Does that make sense? No. Anyway, so I searched up like portraits, people drawing self-portraits and like how they did it and stuff. And one that came up when I searched it up was Joanna Sedia's self-portrait. And she not only did a self-portrait once, but twice. I think it looked really good both times, but she like roasted herself a lot in the video. She said it looked horrible. So I thought she attempted it twice. I'll attempt it a third time. So to get better at drawing my face, I'm gonna draw her face. Let's start. So I already tried doing an art video on my channel and I followed a Bob Ross video with crayons. And that video was two freaking hours of footage that I had to edit down to 10 minutes. Cause I had like, I tried to be fancy. I don't know what I was doing. I had like a freaking tripod up here filming what I was doing. Two cameras, a camera right there. Light, like I was going all out for some reason. And like, it didn't really make that much of a difference. It just took me two days to edit, 10 hours each day. And I stayed up like really late editing it. I don't want to go through that again. That was horrible. <laughs> Wait, are you gonna review the, the portrait that she did? Wait, who gave you permission to talk? Raise your hand. Please. <laughs> yes. Um. So. <laughs> so, so uh, are you gonna draw the same picture that she drew of herself, or is it gonna be different? Should I do the same? Yeah, I'll do the same. All right, so I'm gonna do the same one she drew. How does it look like again? Should I do it from memory? All right, bet. I'm doing it from memory. Be quiet. I'm cute. Alright, so I just drew the whole thing from memory. Let's see how it looks. This took about four hours. And this is, I'm gonna do it again, obviously, by looking at the picture. But this is what I did from memory. What do you guys think? So I drew her hair like in a cute little ponytail. Her glasses, which are really, I think they're really chic. Her nice little smile, a little sarcasm there. Like, oh, Mona Lisa, who is she actually smiling? Is she not? We don't know. And like, all right, I kind of like did her dirty on the hairline part. She's not Jojo Siwa, but. I think the rest of it looks pretty good. So I just spent a good amount of time trying to find the actual picture, but the only thing I could find is the picture of the thumbnail of the, her picture. The frig. The picture of the thumbnail of the picture. So I guess I'm gonna have to zoom into that. I'm gonna have to draw it from a phone because I don't feel like bringing a laptop all the way up here. Going down the stairs, going all the way back upstairs. Okay, so like I said, I'm gonna zoom in on this and just draw it from here. That's gonna be really hard to do because it's tiny. All right, so I'm gonna draw her tiny too. Actually, I think I kind of already did it really good. How long did that take you? Like four hours. Well, I'm gonna draw it in time lapse, probably a few comments here and there, because I don't know, I've been editing a lot recently. I have no social life. I mean, I never had them before, but now I just can't binge Netflix all the time. So yeah. You. Hi, can you see me? I mean, that's actually scary. Instead of using this big paper, I'm gonna use my little brother's sketchbook. Aww. Ew! That's, it's actually not bad, but he just didn't freaking finish it. Why does he have like half a beard? Yeah. Ew, the autistic cat. <laughs> the autistic cat. All right, so I'll just start it off in time lapse and I'll explain here and there. Don't that boy like a basketball and if you don't, don't shake it at all. So already I erased everything that I did. Why does she look like the world record egg? Hey, why are you roasting her? Okay, I'm not roasting her. It's a compliment. That freaking egg is worth 50 million likes. That's way too close to my face. Oh my god. Okay, stop. Look at that. He put it up. He made it himself. He wanted to make like a little board. I literally just found a piece of cardboard and stuck it on the wall. It's don't okay. Make, I like it. Don't make me roast you. I like it. It's don't make I like roast. it. It's creative. Attempt number two. Bounce that booty like a basketball. If you don't, don't shake it at all. Bounce that booty like a basketball. If you don't, don't shake it at all. Oh, 
here's what I have so far. Not gonna lie, she looks like a Mora. So here's what I have so far. Um, the shading is as usual, very like usually first draw it really lightly or whatever, and then go in with a stub. But I just can't help myself. As soon as I see these things, I have to go right in. So there's like a lot of parts that aren't shaded right. See, and the proportions as usual aren't right because I just rush into it, especially the nose. I'm so sorry, Joanna. But also, I don't know what I did to the chin. That she has like a nice little indent there. I just made it look like she got socked. Here she has a tiny little mole thingy, ma jig. What the frick is that? <laughs> Ew, why do your stinks burp? I mean... <laughs> what so another thing I noticed is that whenever I do freaking portraits or anything, I always overestimate the size of the eyes. Like when I first sketch it, it looks like the eyes, I make them too small. And then when I add like shading and I add the eyelashes, I always find out that I drew the eyes way too big in comparison. If you draw a picture that looks nothing like it, you'd be like, Oh, I'm just drawing an abstract image. You thought I messed up? I did that on purpose. So that's what you do when you draw something wrong. So for me, I'm drawing a doll-like, abstract, unblended drawing style. So yeah, you thought I did our bad? Whoa, if you think about it, erasers are like Facetune. Like, look at this. This is the smoothing tool. Drawing is just real life Facetune. So I just have the brows left. I'm gonna talk as I draw with you guys, you know, just a regular old art channel, just giving you what do they call it when you talk while you draw? I don't freaking know. But my brothers are fighting like full on downstairs, which is always like honestly, it's pretty boring in this house. But when they're fighting like straight up, it's kind of like a movie. Like they say they roast each other. I sit there watching it. Sometimes I get in on it. This looks disgusting. Bill, yeah. you're in big trouble. Why am I in big trouble? Is that Emma Chamberlain? Damn. <laughs> My brother's called Joanna Sedia Emma Chamberlain. Who's that's Joanna? that's. Joanna, that looks nothing like her. Who is Joanna Kitty? Hey. Ariana Grande, actually. Well, that's actually kind of a compliment. At least you didn't roast her. It's a roast. <laughs> oh. Guys, not only did my phone just die, I decided I was like, all right, I'll just finish it all off camera and then I'll just do a final outro after my phone charges while I was finishing it. I didn't mean to freaking smudge the entire thing. Now she has a unibrow. So not only did I draw hideous brows on, I also gave her a hideous unibrow. Her eyes are smudged, hair is smudged. I know I seem like I'm calm, but that's how I act when bad things happen. I'm just like, oh, great. I don't know, I want to give up now. I'll fix it. It's fine. Finally, after all that time, all that effort, all that blending, I'm finished for real. But here's the completed picture of Joanna Sedia. So obviously compared to the original picture, the darks are too light, the lights are too dark. No, just the darks are too light. A lot of parts are still like kind of smudged from when I smudged it with my hand accidentally because like you could see like little streaks on the paper. All right, thanks again for watching. If you guys like this video, what is that? thumbs it up as usual, all the YouTuber stuff, whatever. So before I get into the actual video, let me just explain what I'm doing. Wait, no. So before I get into the actual video, let me give you a little background on my drawings. No. So before I get into the actual video, let me...